Hello and welcome back. I'm Bebal Joe and this is War Customer Resources Soviet Republic. It's been so long and I'm so excited to get back into this for many, many reasons. Uh, the biggest one probably, uh, there's a lot more city space that needs to be spaced out and uh, configurated. And after that, we have to build a couple more industries and probably also eventually cross this dang river that's over there. I mean, it's a river wilderness and all that. Um, but yeah, there's more. There's also a track that has to be laid out over here and just stuff everywhere. There's there's no shortage of things to do, so let's get to it. First, most of you caught it. Um, this city was not ready to go, mostly because this whole heating system up here wasn't ready to go. I did add another fire station over here too, um, in case you're wondering. But water wasn't ready, heat, uh, ready, heat wasn't ready, power wasn't ready, nothing was ready to get, uh, get going in this area. So that was not very... Pleasant. Let's put it that way. Also, um, the housing that we had here left over from the initial setup was not enough to even run the couple industries that we have here. Even at this point, we barely get anyone uh, waiting, waiting in this area. There's some passengers waiting because they feel like it, but overall, we're not filling, well, that one's not running. We're not filling these out. We're not filling these out at all. We don't need to fill out water anymore at this point. Um, especially since I also think they upgraded these. Do I have to rebuild them to get the updated water production? 300, 300, 120, 120. No, I don't think so. There have been a lot of updates on the power, not on the power, but on the water flow piece that I'm not terribly worried about right now because we were in the green before and now we're just more in the green. Uh, population's going up. These numbers look fine. I uh, was just literally waiting for everything to get done and it took forever. So, um, it is what it is. I hope I don't make any more stupid mistakes because they're annoying. Yeah, we have another radio station here that helps a little bit with, you know, the usual. <laughs> cool. Yeah, let's build our, um, the rest of what we have to build here. My plan is, at this point, to maybe have a large terminal station out here that connects to uh, the rail pieces over here, simply because the station that's over here if I make it a main uh, transport hub, is going to be completely overloaded. And there are only two connections. And you know what happens when you have an overloaded hub with only two connections? This. This one technically has four connections, but really it only has three. And we just, there's always stuff just waiting in this, this little corner. Um, and that's not very helpful. I would love to get to that city over there, but we, we just don't have... Uh, we, we need so many more things. I would like to get electronics. I would like to get a cloth. I would like to get clothing. I would like to get a mechanical component. Mechanical components we're actually building right now. Um, but just, there's a lot more to do. Um, and we need a lot more people to actually work on it. There's this whole piece in the middle here that we can all industrialize. But let's get started, shall we? Yes, we shall. What do we have going on here? I think I added a couple more schools just in general because we, we needed it. We we really needed it. And as you can see, the kindergarten is also pretty full. Um, this is all going okay. I think I have those set up. Okay, just, just making sure everything is running the way I need it to run and it looks like it is, so we should be okay. There better not be anyone waiting in these places because that'd be silly, <laughs> very silly. Um, but yeah, let's get going. Um, city-wise, it is a capital. I would like to make it look like a capital. We have the center of the capital more to the left side or west side of, of the capital of Dravery, and I'm okay with that. But hey, let, let's just let's just plan out where we would put the uh, terminal because that could help us stretch out the rest of the um, of the city. And we may want to keep in mind that there's a heating station out here or a heating plant out here that we can use and this area feels a little better for just expansion than too far south here. So I'm probably going to put a couple more buildings here, build this out, and then the rest will just concentrate onto uh, this area. Maybe we have some cliffside buildings as well. I don't know yet. Maybe add another another heating plant uh, and so on. You know how things go. I, I never know what I really want to do. And then we figure it out and uh, life is too late. Anywho, what do we have here? Train platform. You are relatively big. Um, I don't hate it. I wouldn't hate putting a bigger one here if we could, but that would really take away a lot of real estate from several different directions. I'm not sure that that is quite what I would like. 
the Holden or Holston stations, they're pretty. I like them. I like the design. Um, but they're not quite what I want. I do want a terminal station. You're also not a terminal station. Should I have looked up uh, at what terminal stations we have available? Yeah, maybe. But no, not really. Um, I know there's at least one in here, so I just have to find it. That one also looks like a really good size. What is this? Also looks like a really good size. We we don't we don't have to connect both sides, that's for sure, but I want to connect both sides. We used a really cool one in I think this one is our best option potentially. We used a nice one in uh, season three at the end, and I wouldn't mind using that one again, but I don't feel that we're really getting getting very far. So if I put you in the far corner up here, right there. Um, then we will have some access. Uh, we will have people that are able to walk there, which is very important. Um, but what we really want is a good train, train interaction with the setup. How should we interact? I think what we should do is give myself, wow, <laughs> having all these trees here makes this a little more complicated. Um, how about we try that again, just a little better, and maybe delete some of the trees so I can actually see something. What I would like to do is use these as my temporary um, entrance uh, connections, and these as my temporary exit connections, um, just ins and outs, and then the middle should be able to connect to that pretty, pretty easily from where the... Um, is that what I want? Nope, nope, already changing my mind. Already changing my mind. We're going to have one in, one out, and that means the middle should be our real connection. Let's see, if we use snapping, is there a straight snap that we can use here? There's nothing that is perfectly straight, so may as well just leave it alone. <laughs> just, let's be honest. It's just gonna look terrible if we, if we do it the wrong way. If we get these now uh, curved in a little bit and connected up to here, I saw something from Hamuda today, and I kind of really liked it, so I'm going to try something very similar. Oh, oh, come on. The last piece is the one way you're going to make cause me trouble. There you go. Now everything's connected. Beautiful. Very good. Um, we have six. Six coming in. Um, two leaving. That's what these two are going to be. I am making this a little longer just in case I need it. Are we going to have this many trains here? Oh, questioning myself. Are we going to have six trains making it to this station all the time? I think the answer has to be yes. Otherwise, what I'm doing right now is completely useless. So that's fine. Six trains. What what does this station hold? How many people can can wait at this station? Fifty eight hundred. Yeah, yeah, definitely. This is this is mostly going to be a station that's concentrated on bringing workers. So I think I am okay with with this layout with this setup. Back this up. If I can save some space, I will, uh, because we will need all the space that we can get for uh, residential buildings and, you know, city city business. Now I have this one come over here, have this one come in here. Yep, yeah, that's good. Make this a little bit um, mirrored, mirrored. Yep, yeah, that's good. And then just the last one, whoa. The last one, I see they haven't fixed the uh, the visual on the on the rare connections yet, I will, I will forgive them. But please, soon, uh, make the rail dot red again, or just some color that someone can actually see. There's one, that's what we wanted. And connect that one here, now we have the crossover, and now everything can connect exactly where we need it. I do hope that there's not going to be a lot of need for queuing um, in this general area, that would be very good. Uh, because once we get into queuing here, I think we have a lot of other problems. Get that one in there. That looks nice. Get this one out here. Should have done the inside first. Nope, got lucky. And I'm pretty happy with that. That station is going to be mostly for passengers. And I can probably run at least 10 trains through there, which is a lot. If each train handles about 600 people, that's a big train set, then this will be good. Something I will definitely change is this road is not going to be a normal road anymore. It will be a bridge. Otherwise, I think we will hate everything. Um, okay, get this assigned. That looks good. 
get me a road connection. Road, road, road. Something right here. Should I raise? I should probably raise this a little bit. I don't, honestly, no, I don't want to raise it a lot. We're just going to do a normal bridge. Uh, something that is nice to look at. How about, how about, how about? Hmm. Yeah, we'll just do this. I uh, can't see anything. We'll just do... Mm, I can't see from either side. <laughs> it's not helpful. Uh, okay. Let's get this up to here. Then give me the bridge that I want. I kind of really like this bridge. So one, two. If we hit E, two hopefully are enough. Two, pl uh, two plops. Two are not enough. Uh, three plops are hopefully enough. <laughs> uh, one, two, three. So far, so ugly because it places the pillars in really bad spots. See, I don't, I don't want to make it ugly. I'm actually trying to make this pretty right now. Hamuda has poisoned my mind with making things look nice. So that is not very helpful. Let's see. If I put you back a little further. One, two, three. Um, that is semi all right. And this one we can actually place that the pillars are somewhat acceptable and then one two three come down here be symmetric i would call that symmetric i'm okay with that and then pull this one here and this one is just a little bit out of whack i'm okay with that uh the street engineer was sleeping on the job that's fine um yeah get that assigned cool so they can start on that any buildings Already, already put out. Nothing to worry about, so that is good. Anyone stuck anywhere? You're just moving relatively slow. Since I turned on exporting uh, fuel, we're having a lot more money, and that's where most of this money is coming from, so don't be alarmed. Everything is fine. Nothing really has changed there. But here we go. Um, that one is set up and happy and good to go. I am kind of pleased with that so far. The next thing that I want is a just a quick bus platform, bus station. Uh, definitely do the big one. Do we have? Do you have a cool looking one? Um. Ooh. Actually, this one has a bus connection. It doesn't have a lot of bus connections, but it has a bus connection, so I can drop right into the station uh, for every for every bus run that I want to run here, and that is actually perfect. Let's use I don't know I, I don't want to use snapping here because I know the city itself is not on a grid so I don't want to go there but I do want to use um, the back half of the of this area just for the city to make it well bigger because we need a lot of workers and uh, just see how this goes there. I, th I think that's fine. That's fine. Uh, things auto save. That feels fine. Just an extra little run over there. I am planning on using a lot more um, footpaths to connect everything else, so don't judge me on all of that yet. Okay, I think this is good. Um, there is a large large grocery store over there already. I think that's the next thing that we need to do here. Utilities. Let's figure out utilities in this area uh, and just go down the list. Residential areas. Nothing here that we need. Shopping center. Yes. I'm happy with just doing the exact same shopping center again. And I'm totally fine with building that really close to this um, hub. Central hub. Um, because it, it generally makes life a lot easier. So plopping you down here should be good. Then I learned that the cargo station, the smaller cargo station is actually over here under what was it uh under seven that is factory connections for whatever reason we'll just allow that should i make the city have asphalt roads <laughs> i mean <laughs> maybe I, I don't want to i don't want to wait that long but there's a cargo station now it could be a warehouse but a cargo station has enough parking spots that we don't actually need a warehouse there so that looks good um, restaurant? I don't mind having one. Should we place a new cinema? Yes, we should. We should. And again, 
I would like to concentrate this around that new central station over there. Um, but only for buildings that actually need road connections, we shall have road connections connecting them. Um, otherwise, it's just silly. Then, next thing, Palace of Communism. We are in the capital. And this, I believe, yes, there's a, there's a slight hump. I was going to put it the other way, but it has a road connection. It doesn't have any footpath connections at all, so we'll have to connect you like this. Otherwise, nothing is going to work, and that should be fine. Yeah, uh, we're getting some other buildings in here that I usually don't place, but you do get culture and some other things out of this, so it's not completely useless. You are complaining to me about reasons, and I know what your reasons are. Did I remove the cross over here? I did not remove the cross over here. So what we're going to do... There's only currently one, uh, one train going, going to the station, so this should be honestly okay. Oh, this is actually already past the station. That, that makes my life a lot easier. Now, this is all just one block. That guy should be able to turn around, and it's turning around inside the station. That makes my life a lot easier. You. There you go. Yeah, figure out where you're going. Get out of here, <laughs> as they say. Uh, okay, continue with what we were doing. We had residential areas. Okay, uh, do we have a big pub that could work here? 18 people, the normal one is 60. Feels like a lot. Uh, 50, 60, 120. Woody's bar, that's too small for, for a pub like that. Bar with road access. Uh, you, need, you need water, we, yeah, we can't have that. Uh, what about this one? 180. It's also just a small one. I want something a little bigger, otherwise... <laughs> a little bigger. Um, you know what? It feels like something that exists in um, areas, especially near large train stations. So, you know what? Allow it. Allow it. A big, big old bar right there. Um, let's make sure that our construction crews are actually constructing things that I am allowing to be constructed here. And it looks like we are, so that should be good. Yeah, these guys get moving. Uh, cool. Let's continue with our tasks. Uh, we got that one, Beach Cafe Bar. Don't have enough water and... Mm, no, probably, probably no Beach Cafe here. Culture is done. TV station. This is the capital. I don't have, well, I have the TV tower, but I don't have a different TV station at this point. This could be a lovely location for it. So does this. Just overlooking, overlooking the rail connection that's behind it. I kind of like this one better. All I have to do now is actually fit it in here into the landscape. Um... I don't see a good reason why we can't do this. Level terrain, hide from center. Yep, that looks good. Where is our... Um, this is the highest, this is the lowest. So somewhere in here, probably where we want to do this. No, no. Honestly, that, that feels like we're just lowering too much. We're lowering too much here. I'm fine with making this a mountain or raising a mountain out of here. We just have to make it smart or do it smartly. So first, let's speed up our, our process. <laughs> Much better. I hope I'm not missing anything while we do this. Um, but yeah, let's just raise this. If you are allergic to this type of uh, landscaping, there is a nuclear bulldozer that's a lot faster. There's also the... Um, the terrain manipulation tool and the cheat mode that you can use. Both of them speed this up a lot. It is not... I mean, it's not forbidden. You can play however you want to play, and I do understand that some people actually have a problem with Carpal Tunnel uh, doing this because it does take a little while, but there are there are ways to get around it to make in playing more enjoyable for you. So please use those use those tools when they are appropriate and when they become uh, necessary. Um, just, just a side note. So, looks like we don't have a lot of rock here, which is very, very good. And I think we're getting close to size where I can actually place the TV station right here. There's a little cliff on the on the south side of the TV station. That's not going to be a real problem. Okay, let's see. Uh, TV station. Yep. TV station, you're bigger than I expected, but I saw something yellow blink at me. 
There we go. Um, and now when we use the bigger buildings, the terraforming should in general be a little faster. What I would like to do is get you close to the rail, so Railwatch fans can actually see something, um, but still just be like on that corner on the city. We're going to play something else there. I don't know what yet. I'm also going to let them complete their uh, construction here so we don't interrupt that. Very good. I like it. I'm happy with that. Uh, radio station, don't need it. Indoor pool or activities. I would actually like something different that can actually work that has sport as a uh, as a need that it can satisfy. Embankment's not helpful. And if you're a small training hall, not very helpful. We can put 90 people in here. That is a lot. 175 big sports hall. This feels like a good size. And why not put it right in front of the, radio, of the TV station? Because usually TV stations are so large that they, in fact, have their own um, entertainment district. <laughs> so why not? Throw that one in there. Um, the Republic's National Production Center zone thingy. I like it. Uh, okay, now we are in this area. Let's get some basic utilities. Totally happy. Well, am I happy putting this here? I don't know if I'm happy putting this there. Probably should put you here. Then you are near everything, but also close enough to everything. Yep, I'm happy with that. You can go there. Um, let's get a good hospital. Do we have a different one? Um, it looks different. I like it. Um, should be working just fine. Don't expect many problems from here. And putting it far enough away from... Actually, i put you in the corner here and connect both, both road pieces. Would look a little funny. Um, but we could put a park right in front of it. I like it. I like that idea. I uh, get you in here. I do this right now. If I don't do it now, I will just forget. Um, but it's also not the end of the world. I was gonna let that that excavator complete its task before I interrupt it, but meh, probably not necessary. Anyways, um, so university we have there. We have food here. We have uh, fire fire coverage. We have what was this? Uh, Don't remember. <laughs> Don't remember. I know this is some palace. That's a TV station. And here is a cinema. Most of these are for culture. So I wouldn't be surprised if this is also culture. But hey, just, just leave it alone. We'll figure out what it is later. Um, orphanage. I may just leave the orphanage out in this case. Um, just doesn't generally treat me very well. 120, 240, 480. This is the biggest one, kindergarten-wise, but it has to be, sadly... No, this is school. This is the school. I'm okay with the school being uh, kind of centered near the near the train station. I'm actually totally happy with that. And it also does not need a, um, a road connection. So that can go right here. Actually, that is something that, in Germany... Um, not necessarily everywhere, but in a lot of places, the there was a large hub for students to get to school. And in this case, there's a very large hub right here. It's not gonna be used for that, I understand that, but now there's a place. We could put a school stop right here in front of it um, and make it look a little more a little more homey maybe. So why don't we just do that? Bus platform, bus platform small. Do we have a nice looking one? Station, nope, too small, way too small. What's this one? That's, that's a better looking station. What size are you? You allow 600 passengers versus 500. I guess this one is is not that bad after all. There's a large station already right there. Um, how about we put one a little bit further away from everything? Um, I'm happy with that. Just the school buses can still get to where they need to get to here, and uh, the students don't have to cross the roads afterwards. Obviously, if we have to, we can totally use the uh, traffic management system that we have now, but maybe we don't need it. I am not 100% sure if this uh, school has a parking lot, so that will potentially cause some trouble down the road, but for right now, we should be fine. Kindergarten. This is the one that we'll just forget and then place later. Um, I do know that I usually forget it, but... Kindergartens, since they have to be in walking range, I don't want to mess with them until we actually know 
um, where they need to go and how many we need. So we're gonna leave that alone. I kind of like how far this is all moving. Oh, oh, this is still not, just not done because it's over there, but that's fine. Cool, 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 cool. Happy with that so far. Um, university. I am not planning on building another one because we already have a university in this town. This could be a commuter train, it could be a commuter bus, I don't really care what it is, but just having something that moves from there to there. Uh, probably a couple buses, honestly. That should take care of all of this, so... University-wise, we're fine. However, um, I may... Should I put a couple dorms in here? Um... Because I'm pretty sure, I tested this before, I'm pretty sure that the dorms that we have will attract students, um, regardless of where they are, um, and then the students from there will take a bus to the actual, um, to the actual universities or like public transport of, of some sort or another. So if I build a small little, um, dorm group right here, they should all be very simply able to um, take, take the train or the bus or whatever I actually end up connecting here to get to wherever they need to go and uh, use the university. I kind of like that idea. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Uh, for some reason I feel like I have to build the, <laughs> the pedestrian crossing right now, so that's what we're doing. Back up a little bit. Uh, pedestrian crossing with bricks, please. Yep, right there. Sure. And sure, make this look nice and pretty. It's not a straight line, it doesn't have to be a straight line. Fine, it's fine. Uh, yep, get you assigned, all that is good. There are a small dormitory here and that's just for people to um, be able to go to school from this side as well. They're not, the dormitory, the dorms are not the greatest invention in this game, but it will be just fine. Um, anything waiting too long, that is fine. Production waiting too long, waiting too long, waiting too long. Yeah, I need to, I need to start using the, um, the harbor that we have over here, but we're not, we're not ready for it yet. So, that's not happening. Anyways, what else do we need? What else do we need? Medical University, yeah, we have all of that. Police station, yes, of course. We need a separate police station in this area. Um, that I'm certain of. I don't know that we need all the other things, but police for sure. Let's just throw it right across from the hospital. Um, I I do like trying to keep my um, nodes for the different road connections um, small, <laughs> not small, but uh, at a at a low number. That doesn't always work, but should be fine. Courthouse, we already have one. Prison, we have one. Secret police. I would assume. Um, that we need another one out here. Let's just put it just a little out of the way. We're, we're going to build a lot of housing here, so I'm not I'm not terribly worried about how far this is away. Um, and that that honestly feels pretty good. This one is done now, so we can let these guys get built. This one just needs a footpath connection. I kind of like this. I remember that for season three. I was building the capital more as a haphazard thingy because it was very much at the end and we didn't need it anymore. And that I think that broke um, a lot of the my goals or my ideas that I had for it. But I'm, I'm pretty happy with this. Are we working on this? No, it's just out of range. So let's just get these assigned to what they need to do. Uh, there you go. Got that one. That one is not there. These ones are fine. You are constructing that already. That's good. Why not just go to the other side? Um, there I probably have to babysit a little bit, but that's also quite okay. Um, everything is assigned. That looks good. I like it. Okay, what else do we need? Obviously utilities. But utilities are something that I'm probably going to do at the very end. Um, we have an accounting office over here. I'm not planning on making that move. So Strakarov, if I can actually remove you, I do understand that you were the original um, capital from the other season, but not anymore. Dravori, looks like Dravori is not getting all of this. So what we probably have to do is get a new city name area here. Call you Strakarov, because that's a better name. And then, um, where are you? Dravori. 
from a view. Strakarov, do you cover the whole capital? You cover the whole capital right now. You're not covering this area. That means it has to be, there should be one more small name that I can't see. There's a name right here. Do we have something close enough? Nope, I'm close enough. Where do you think you're Lolona? Where is Lolona? Where is the word Lolona? There's Rira. Rira. That's not helping. Lolona. Strakarov. Expecting it to be somewhere over here, but I can't. Oh, Lolona, right here. Okay, go away. You are now part of Strakarov. Perfect. So Strakarov is this whole this whole area now. Beautiful. Like it. Um, and that should work. Cool. Um, what else do we have? Well, they will have to start building this. How are we looking on? Nobody's without a flat right now. That is kind of impressive to me. I, um, we had some problems with that before, but apparently not right now. And that is good. It's very good for us, uh, obviously. But we need more. We need more done. I think I have everything built besides kindergartens. Uh, technical service. Yeah, sure. I don't see a good reason because we will be very dependent on bus transport. 100%. So having an internal uh, street cleaner or um, sweeper as part of the business should be fine. So putting one there should be okay. I think we want one more bus station out here. Do we have another one that looks, nope, that looks ridiculous. Uh, what's this, XL bus station. How big are you? XL bus station, 1,000, that's too big. 200 is too small, 1,500 too big, 750. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with this size. Sure, right there. Uh, wait a second, there you go. And then you can connect right into here. I do understand I'm gonna interrupt that construction there, but I don't wanna wait any longer. So yeah, now we have a bus station there, bus station here, bus station here, bus station here, and effectively a bus station here that should cover most of all the places that we care about. Um, we could leave this as a round or as a, um, as a road that just goes around everything, but I'm not sure that that is necessary. Something that I would like to use is the end stations. Uh, why? Because they are cool. Trolley bus end station, that's nice that they added that. There's a bus end station right here. Um, since there's a station right here, I feel that just adding maybe two... Two is maybe enough for what we need. Where should I put those? I can just put them right here so I don't have to cross the road. Uh, and they're, they're technically right behind the bus state uh, the um, fuel station, even though they will fill up with fuel uh, within the end stations. Um, and for the buses that I want to run here, they should all be um, pretty easy. Pretty easy picking. Get you flattened out. That looks good. Get you connected in there. That is good enough. And could you start it? Cool. I like it. So there's the bus end station. That is all taken care of. All of our normal utilities and infrastructure is being built. Pollution monitoring station. I don't see a good reason why I don't want this. Just in case. In case I do something stupid. At least I can diagnose it a little more. And that should be good. Should I put a different fire station down? Airport small fire station. Oh, that's cute. I need to use that. Um, did I say there's an airport up here? I think at some point I said that this is going to be an airport. Um, and I still like that. <laughs> and I still really like that. We don't have a train connection to it right now. Um, but we can fix that once we have to. So, yeah, that's fine. Um, what's this? What's, what's going on over here? You're not building on there yet. That is not very helpful. So, construction office. Get move on get all of those that looks good can't do that one okay um buildings how many workers do i want here at this point we have five thousand just in this blob i would like twenty thousand in the end um that could be a problem with um frame rate and all that stuff but i we just need a lot of people is really what this comes down to so yeah, let's get let's get started with that. Should I do should I do water and sewage right now? I'm gonna go with no. I, I don't wanna do it. 
Still don't know what this one is. <laughs> Still don't remember what that one is. No one's going to tell me, but um, it's fine. We'll figure it out. So, um, in the middle of the city, we should probably have... I don't want to say rundown, but less sophisticated. No, that, that's also unfair. I don't, I don't think they're less sophisticated at all. Um, just a couple of these buildings. Um, just right near the... Right near the railroad tracks. I like that. Actually like that a lot. This is a pretty cool layout. Um, because then we can still put some sport in the middle of it. And soccer is always welcome. Like that. Cool. Um, can we put one more? No, that looks squeezed. But putting one right here does not look squeezed. There's always something really close to the railroad. So I'm, I'm actually kind of happy with this. And it's not... You, you can't call you can't call me out on this and say this is too tightly packed because it's the opposite of that. Get you here. That looks good. Um, get you there. Fine. Get you in here, and then just a couple more. A couple more basic connections, and we should be in pretty good shape. That one there. Okay, that looks fine. And some greenery in there uh, should make that also relatively uh, nice to look at. I like it. Okay, um, I stopped here because I felt that that's a good, good place to put a um, well, railroad crossing. Like this. Put one there. Oh, come on. I'm going to say there's not enough space on this side to make this actually look pretty. Let's try that again. Shall we? Yeah, we shall. Come around. And... Uh, I'm not going to fight it too much. It's fine. If that's where you want to be, then that's where you're going to go. That's fine. Um, okay. So that can go there. That is fine. We could put another one right here. Uh, of course, you can say you don't actually need pedestrian overpasses. You can just build a um, just a level crossing right across it, and that is very true. I just I'm trying to make it a little pretty, okay? And I think having these overpasses like this will look really nice when you drive under it with the trains. So I'm hoping it pays off. That's all. Uh, okay, so we got a couple buildings down. How many? You go home. Thank you. Uh, let's just assign that. How many workers can live inside that building at this point? I don't think it's a lot. It's like one of these. 170 maybe. Probably. That's that's all right. That's all right. Could be worse. What is this? Centipede single, centipede full. What are you? Ooh. Ooh, I don't hate you. I don't hate you. 720 workers. Um, right next to students. Just in the middle, like a, like a, um, I, I don't hate this building. Just having a couple here right in the center and then a couple more potentially here. That's about 2,000 people that are just placed here. I'm, I'm quite happy with that. If centipede small, it's just a little less pompous than, yes, yes, that is great. Uh, place a couple more here. I, I very much like it. I, I really, 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 really like this. Uh, put one there and put one here. Perfect. Um, that's the heart. That's the heart of the um, of the capital. There's some space here. Should I place some more small centipedes there? Or should I put a large centipede a long way? I think we're gonna put it the long way. It fits right here. It just feels right. And it's just it's just in the center. It's not everywhere. So calm down. I hope this looks fine. Uh, I like it. Um, I think I will like it when it's done. Okay, great. So we got uh, 1,500, about 3,000, 4,000 people here, plus another six or 700 there. That is great. Um, these should all be in range of one or the other shopping center. So that is helpful. What we definitely need to need to add now, uh, before I forget, is kindergartens. 
and ideally bigger than 100 because 100 is not going to cut it. This one's 480, it's a little too big. 180 is actually a pretty good size, um, especially in a situation where we have a lot of large buildings like right here. So plopping one in here should help and plopping one right across from the, from the high school should also help. Excellent. I like it. I like it a lot. What other buildings do we have that I really like? Um, okay. Nice large brick house. And large brick house has... Um, it's this one, right? 195 versus 160, 120, 410. Oh, oh, this, this is not, this is not pompous at all. I like it. Um, yeah, that's what we're going to do. One... Two, three, I'm not going to connect those, four, five, six, I could put those a little closer together, but I'm not, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, say what you will, I feel really good about these. Um, you store 400, so I just made another 4,000 can live there. Excellent. Um, now I feel good about the, the thing that we put there. Uh, while we're here, let's make this look planned, shall we? Just plan, plan all these buildings inside here. There's nothing else that we're going to build there. Do these need to be on the outside there? Probably not, but I started it, so I should probably finish it. Um, and they're all oriented the same way. I like it. You can fit a lot more of these if I put them next to each other and kind of stack them, but um, I'm going away from that, okay? I'm going away from that. So let me have my fun with these guys. Thank you very much. Uh, 288, have a couple more of these maybe? Sure. 300, 600, 900, and uh, 1200. So another, another dozen people there. Perfect. Uh, back to the usual stuff, which is kindergarten. Nope, that's not kindergarten. Kindergarten is... Ch -ch -ch, there, medium kindergarten. Large daycare, 360. What does this look like? Oh, it's like, it's, it's ocean stuff, or it's water stuff. Don't know how I feel about that. 150, 150, 264, 120, 600. No, no this is just wrong. <laughs> that size is just wrong. 180... 480 feels appropriate for what I just plopped down here, but unless I move anything, it's not going to work. I'm fine with moving stuff. Uh, move a thousand people away somewhere. We're going to replace them, don't worry. And plop this one right in the center of all of this, and hopefully everyone can get to it. And then find the residential buildings again, which were these. Uh, I could plop you really close here. Apparently you're, um, you're not overlapping perfectly, so that's fine. Up one there, and... Nope. I don't think that fits there. I don't think that fits there either. It's just going to be two smaller ones. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Totally. Yep. 88, put one here and this one here. There you go. Uh, beautiful. That is good. That has this guy now. You still need some sport, probably. Oh, I think this was a big gym. I think that's what this was. It's just a big gym. Oh, no, it's the pub. <laughs> it's a big pub. <laughs> Not a gym at all. Uh, this is the gym. And that gym is actually pretty close in range of what's going on over here, so I'm kind of liking that. I do feel that I need to plop at least a couple pools down, down in this area as well, probably further out here. Now uh, we can even, even squeeze it in here, I think. Can I rotate you? I like it right there. That's fine. Um, and then just sprinkle some some normal um, facilities around town. I think that's healthy. I want soccer place a spot there, one right here, and then give me a couple tennis courts. Um, because we all know someone from, um, 
from this area that plays tennis, right? Okay, okay, okay. These are not the best ones to place, not at all, but it's gonna work. Um, and if there's a big gym over there, I think we need at least one more gym out here. Probably more than that. Um, so we're gonna figure that out soon enough. But that feels good. Um, da -da 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 -da. Let's go back to residentials then. What else do we have that I haven't placed yet? Uh, 368. Uh, this doesn't look bad. This doesn't look bad at all. Do we have more room over here? There is room out on this edge. Um, may as well use it. Here we go, just a little denser, uh, but I don't want to take up the space or the the uh, the limelight from the TV station over there. So that should be fine right there. Place just a handful. Again, I'm not counting exactly how many people we have here. So I hope that is okay. I kind of like this block. Not humongous, but it has a pretty good capacity. So how about we plop you here. This nice block of something on this block. And I really like this. Thank you, modders. <laughs> Thank you, modders, for making all of this come together for me. Uh, I like that. I like that. That, that looks nice and planned. I'm happy with that. Uh, we haven't done anything on this side. If I find some buildings that I really want to put there, I will. Otherwise, it's just what it is right now. Obviously, there's no utilities placed at this point. And I didn't forget. I'm just not doing it yet. Okay, so there's all of this. This feels pretty full. This feels pretty full at this point. There's still this odd shape piece, but we don't really have any uh, utilities or any anything else in there. There's this one. We can fill this one in and the rest we can just do some other time. I don't know what we're going to do with it at this at this stage, to be honest. Um, what do we have? What do we have? Stalinka? Uh, yeah, we tried this before, I think. I don't like it. Now we're talking. This I like. Uh, yes. Yes, right there, please. Right there, right there, right there. I am excited to see how this all looks when it's all done. Um, not even just the numbers of citizens that can fit here, but also just everything about it, because I do feel driving through this with a train would actually be really cool once we're done. Ooh! All the rail is done uh, for the train station besides this one. I have to do that later. I have to switch a bunch of signals for that, and I don't want to do that at this stage. Um, get you out here. That looks nice. Um, how about... Oh, there's no there's no footpath connection there. That's a little unfortunate, but okay. Get you in there. Why do I do the footpaths right away? I, I will forget if I don't do it now. <laughs> it's the main reason here. So uh, don't judge me. I do feel... Let's see, there's a, there's this guy. I do think these will be in range to walk here, but not in range anywhere else. So there needs to be another bus station out on this side. Oh, there's a bus station there already. Um, but there's no bus station here. So probably a bus station right here. Uh, something else that can fit a couple people. Um, this one would be cool, but only if you're useful, uh, if you're useful. I think you're useful out here. Sure, we're going to plop you right there. That looks good. Uh, more of these. Luckily, we can use um, machinery now to build these uh, footpaths, which at some point when I played, which I don't remember when that was that was not the case but now it's definitely the case and these footpaths even if they're really short really don't take that long anymore and it's awesome um it makes life a lot easier for everyone involved very good um, let's connect you to yeah i'm excited for this to get done To realize that's a big one uh these guys have to be constructed at some point that should be fine let's get your connection there connection here oh this is this is just a big city this is great 
Everything about this is great. Should be great. Will be great. Eventually. Okay, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. I think you're the only one that's not connected yet. And this one... If I really want to use it, I actually have to give you a footpath there. Um, otherwise, it's not gonna it's not gonna do anything. Same on this end. Nice, nice. Get all of those assigned. Great. Um, yeah, we don't have to stack everything. We just need to make sure that everything can kind of be reached uh, by something, by one one one, by some way. Something has to be able to reach these. So that one can go there. That one can go there. And this one can go here and there. That should be good. Then one more. Already connected to a normal footpath. That is perfect. Get you there, get you there. Get you here, and get you here. And then, um, oh, another bus station out here that we definitely need. Oh, I'm excited for this. As I'm, I'm very excited for this. I... I've not 100% decided how I want to do the bus lines um, because I do want to use that end station. Um, but the end station may not be necessary because I can also see myself just making one bus line per station. It goes there to the bus line, down here to the bus line, and so on. It's just distributing them ev evenly. I can also see myself having just one large bus um Bus route that goes everywhere all the time uh, that could happen I'm, i may just have to play play around with that and see what works best for me and what doesn't so we'll see um again haven't made up my mind yet so that means it's it's not decided <laughs> let's go there let's go here that looks good you all already connected that is nice this one just use the same one there. This one, just run behind here. I'm excited for this. This all feels very, 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 very nice. Even even looks nice, in, in my eyes at least, so hope that's fine. Definitely don't want to build a large, uh, or a crossing here. So either a tunnel or one of these guys. Let's use the steel one instead. Um, you're not going to go there. You may go here. I'm playing with it, it's not symmetric. Um, let's see if I can get one, but the pillar was not being placed in the location where I wanted it. You see that? That's why I want the pillar. I think this one just has to move out a tiny bit and then we should be able to get something. Oh, look at that, perfect. Um, right there is good. You just, come on, there you go. You go there, you can come out a little further. Oh no. Okay, fine, whatever. You can go there. Um, and then while we're here, just to make it look prettier, we'll just put another, another footpath like this that goes down. Um, that should make all these connections a lot easier. And nicer to look at. You go there, you go there, you go there. Yeah, I like it. Um, footpath, footpath, footpath. <laughs> uh, okay, let's get maybe the last ones in here. If you come out this way, I don't know what I'm going to do with you yet. So, yes, yes, yes. Probably yes. Thanks, so, I'll save. Um, go here, go here. Not sure if this one's in the range of anything, but we can add more and more bus stops in most of these locations, so I'm not terribly worried about that either. Yeah, this one may be a little far away for you. Um, so if I make it just a little more accessible. Building in the way, huh? Uh, maybe now? Nope. That one can't be accessible. <laughs> so, okay. Uh, what else do we have? This guy needs to connect to something. You are the shopping center. You definitely have to connect to a lot of things. There, there, there. And then... 
here. Because why not? You go there, and then this one I think is the last thing of footpaths that we have to connect, and then we're actually done. I'm excited for that. What's that? That's a soccer field. Don't need the soccer field to be directly connected, but that's fine. Okay. Good. Good. Like that little swan neck in there makes it look a little more homey. That works. Swan neck. Nice. Um, you can come on here. Very nice. Very nice. I like it. I just like where this goes. We could have done this in a time lapse and all that stuff, and that is all nice and well, but honestly, I do feel very, very accomplished doing this here right now, and um, yeah, it did take me a lot longer than I wanted it to take me, but enjoyed it, because I did. And it's been so long since I did a video, so maybe, maybe that cuts me some slack too. Not there, yes there. Uh, probably here. Okay. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And we still have these guys. Can we connect you? Yes, we can. You there. There, you there. Not sure what we're going to put in the middle there yet, but it's not important. Um, this is a bus stop. So people, please connect to your bus stops. Important. You should be able to get there pretty easy. You should be able to get there. Here's a soccer field that is not connected to a lot yet. There you go. There's another soccer field. Ooh. Um, okay. This one. That works. Also works, also works. That goes there, that goes here. Yep, no, I, I like it. <laughs> however this comes out and however it looks in the end, I kind of like it. I do hope that this TV station is going to be reachable from... Uh, from the train station, but I honestly I don't have a big doubt about that. So that all feels good That's a lot of people that we will be able to accommodate in that whole area. So that is very nice Let's make sure That our construction crews know what I want from them, <laughs> which is all of this uh, Yes, we're gonna get that built. We're at the end of the episode um, There's still utilities that need to go in here and mm -mm. I don't know. We may do that. I may not let this run ahead very far because we have all of this to do and then we have the um, the the water city over here to do as well. So we could plan this one next time a little more organized because I would like to have um, a better understanding of how many people I need. And that will be very important. Making sure that everything over here is running as it should. Uh, how many people we need on that side because that's really just for the two dry docks that we get that one built this looks really nice there's still a lot of area that we have free there uh, i did want to put a park here why don't we just do that right meow uh, the big one if we can i know that will fit this way don't really want to fit it this way, do I? Uh, no, that's fine. We'll fit it that way. And then where are trees? I would like just a couple trees just around the this area, and then yeah, we're fine. Ah, uh, cool. Everything's getting built. Maybe I'll upgrade the, the roads to asphalt. I don't think I will. I, I don't know that, that is necessary in this case because the trains are the thing that makes uh, everything move quicker. Um, so I'm not terribly worried about that. 
We have to hook all of this up. We have to get heat and power down into this area. That should be relatively easy. The water one is maybe the interesting one. We may do that next time. I may do heat and um, power without you guys. And then, uh, yeah, we got to plan the next industries. We got to plan the next city and so on, so on. Is this a really big project that's going to take a long time? Honestly, I don't think so, because these guys should move relatively quickly uh, for everything that we need. And we have all the materials now. And uh, this is all hooked up to uh, trains. There's someone just dropping off. What are you dropping off? Electronics. Perfect. So everything is hooked up. Everything is kind of working. And I shouldn't be worried about anything, really. What are we doing here? We're doing really well there. So yeah, no, everything is great. Thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Glad to be back. I hope the next episode you don't have to wait for very long for, but I'm not going to promise that. And you will see it when it comes out. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.